Okay, guys. So, tomorrow I get my bandages off. Thank God. Because the worst thing that I'm having trouble with right now is itching. And by itching, I don't just mean, oh, look, it itches. No, like, everything from about here all the way down to the bottom, down here, itches like you wouldn't believe. And, uh, it's starting to get really old. Um, I've been, like, taking this bandage and pulling it down a little bit and scratching underneath it. And these I obviously ripped off. They were all the way up to here. And I ripped them all down on... Yeah. So, actually, I should look at this, too. Oh, it hurts. Um, the... Drain hole is that dot right there. Um, it's pretty much completely healed. Yesterday I took off the band-aid and I had this little mushroom that was sticking out that was pretty gross. It was, uh, the center of the hole, whatever... What would it be? Scab. That was growing in it. Came off. It was pretty gross. Um, this is literally leaking. It looks red on here, but it's not. It's pretty much completely yellow plasma. And it separates, so it's like yellow with a little bit of red at the bottom. It's really gross. Um, I literally have, like, nothing coming out of here. So it probably could have come out a while ago, but it hasn't. Um, the only thing I'm worried about right now is yesterday I was laying on the couch, and Zoe jumped on my chest, and it hurt really bad right there. Uh, it doesn't hurt anymore right there. It hurts kind of, like, down here. So I think I might have some bruising, so some fluid build up, and since I don't have a drain, it won't come out. Um, I hope she didn't fuck up my nipple, <laughs> but we'll find out tomorrow. Uh, I also found out that those squares that I was talking about, um, if I look under here, they are actually covering my nipples because my nipples are cut out of the foam. So there's like round holes that are covered by gauze. So I can see my own nipples. It looks absolutely fucking disgusting. <laughs> But, uh, I'm sure it'll look better when it's not covered and stuff. I mean, I can't see it. It still has bandaging over it, but I can see where, like, it would be. And I can see darkness and... Yeah. <laughs> so I'm hoping... You keep staring at me. Because you're right there and you're pretty. <laughs> um, I, there's, like, a nest going on over here. Sarah has candy and two dogs and my blanket, and it's, like, nested, and it looks warm and cuddly, and I'm over here by myself, so I keep looking at her. <laughs> now she's laughing at me. <laughs> Alright, uh, that's really all. Um, there's pretty much almost no pain. I kind of feel like I never had surgery. I just feel like I have a big fucking band-aid stuck across my chest, and it's itchy and getting oily and all breaking down because of the grease on my body. So I cannot wait to shower. Um, I'm just going to keep looking at you and make everybody feel like they're missing something. Alright, well, uh, Christmas went well. A lot better than I thought it would. I mean, nobody there doesn't like me, so that's probably why it went really well. People that didn't like me didn't come. <laughs> um, yeah, that's it. What? What'd you say? Probably because they don't like you. Right, as I said, probably because they don't like me. Alright, um... Merry Christmas to everybody. I got plenty of gifts, a lot of food. I'm happy. Um, and I will be putting up a video of the reveal tomorrow if they let me do it. I don't know why they wouldn't, but since it's not Medali doing it, you never know. <laughs> Sarah said they will let her do it. So there will be a reveal. I'll be putting it up tomorrow or Tuesday, depending. But I have nothing to do tomorrow, so probably tomorrow. Okay, guys. I hope everybody had a great Christmas and every other holiday that anybody else celebrates.